to answer this question the centrifugal force appears to be acting or it appears to exist where let us try to consider two cases suppose you have a rotating platform and this is rotating with constant angular velocity and another thing is there is a kind of train or any bus or something that is going with constant velocity here if it is going with some acceleration here when this is rotating with constant angular velocity even though the velocity is constant because it is rotating there will be centripetal force then this is an example of an accelerating frame of reference accelerating frame of reference or we call non inertial frame non inertial frame a rotating frame a rotating frame is a non inertial frame here a bus or something is going forward with some acceleration this is also an example of an accelerating frame of reference but it is not rotating suppose when this is going with some acceleration if there is a box here what happens when this goes with constant acceleration the box tends to slide backward the box tends to slide backward suppose if you have a coin or something this is a center if you have a coin or something when this is rotating the coin will slide away from the center because this is experiencing a force away from the center we call this centrifugal force centrifugal force and here apparently the bus is going with constant acceleration this is sliding backwards but we are not directly applying any force on this mass hence the force that is not directly acting but some force appears to be acting on this so this is sliding backward so the force responsible for making this object to slide is we call pseudo force the pseudo force on an accelerating frame here if the accelerating frame is rotating we call that pseudo force as a centrifugal force centrifugal force is also a kind of pseudo force but that acts in the accelerating frame of reference if that pseudo force acts in a rotating frame of reference we call centrifugal force here in this object moving with constant acceleration in a straight line we call just simply pseudo force so both are pseudo forces the pseudo force acting on a rotating frame is called centrifugal force but not centripetal force but centrifugal force and centripetal force can never make a pair if you observe from outside we call it centripetal if you observe from inside the frame we call it centrifugal when centrifugal force acts there is no centripetal force when centrifugal force acts there is no centrifugal force here in question number 13 the question is the centrifugal force appears to exist in rotating frame of reference and that is a non inertial frame but this is also a non inertial frame but this is not a rotating frame so centrifugal force appears to be acting only in rotating frames but pseudo force appears to act in any kind of non inertial frame both are non inertial frames